As I was saying about life insurance, my universal policy, the way it works is that um, i able to take a loan against the cash value that has built up in the policy. And I can pay it back if I want to. And I could not pay it back. And at the time of my death, then they would deduct the outstanding loan against the life insurance proceeds and then the balance will go to my beneficiaries. So it was a good choice that I made in purchasing that um, after retiring. Uh, it has also benefited me also for some of my trips. Uh, I took a cruise to Alaska in 2019, I took some proceeds from the cash value to apply to that trip. I took my children to and grandchildren to Florida in 2012, and I used some of the cash value proceeds for that. I've used it um, some other ways to help my children, but those are some of the traveling benefits that I have reaped from the cash value. Um, I probably use some on my trip to, I did a cruise to the, and that was in 2017. I took a cruise and we sailed out of uh, Cape Canaveral to Jamaica, Mexico, and Hades. <laughs> Hades. Uh, so, I had wanted to go to Hades when I graduated college in 1975. So, I didn't make it until um, 2017. So, that's what I've used uh, the cash value in my universal life insurance policy. Whole life is another policy that um, cash value um, accrue in. I have a term policy also, and term doesn't accrue any cash value, but you can purchase term cheaper than you can whole life or universal. So that's something for you to think about. If you got a universal policy or if you have a whole life policy, um, there's cash value there. And... It's nothing wrong. Go for it. Reap some of those benefits. And then leave some for your beneficiaries. But I believe in living life while I'm still here. You know, that that's my thoughts. Um, not all. I say what? Work hard, play hard. <laughs> I don't know if I've, if I've played so hard, but uh, I've always loved to travel, love to travel. Traveling is my passion. Traveling is my passion. So I've thought of creative ways to fund my traveling. I've had working vacations to help fund my vacations. I go and work at a location. And then while I'm there, uh, I would, days off from work, I'd be a tourist and go on excursions. So that's the tip for today. The funding strategy, life insurance, cash value. Take some of that cash value while you're still living and reap the benefits of it. All right, until next time, I'll bring you another strategy. I've got a couple more 
to bring to you that uh, I'm utilizing to fund our trip to Hawaii. But I'm so excited. Um, I had told my children one time, uh, when I pass, take a trip. Oh, I wanted them all to take a trip together. No, not anymore. Mm -mm. They can take their proceeds and take a trip by themselves, but not as not collectively anymore. I don't. I, I'm not encouraging that because I got my youngest son. You know, you, he needs to go and travel his way. <laughs> so. <laughs> But uh, I, I, I'm, I'm utilizing some of that cash value to enjoy life now. Uh, I have exhausted all of my deferred retirement plans. I, I told you that in another video, but I'll repeat it again here in case you didn't see that. Um, I took an early retirement in 2003. I was in my 50s then. I'm 70 now, age 70. I'm a golden girl, and I wear the badge with honor, <laughs> three score and 10, 70. But uh, as I was saying is that um, I exhausted that, you know, I have enjoyed it, I spent it. My mother substitute, she passed in 1991 and I had been trying to get her to retire. She had taught school for over 40 years. She passed. She didn't get to enjoy any of her pension. She didn't get to enjoy any of her deferred comp. Mm -mm. That was not going to happen to me. No, and I tell anyone, enjoy your money. Enjoy it. You work for it. You defer it. Spend it. Spend it. I've got some friends they're waiting to age 72 to take it. I don't know. You know, I guess it's okay if they got longevity in their family, but I don't. I took my Social Security at age 62. I did the calculation, and that was the best for me. I know everyone has to weigh their odds and decide. Funding strategy, the cash value from life insurance policy. You can take a loan against it. And at this age, I wouldn't even worry about paying it back. I didn't worry about paying it back when I started maybe some years ago. You know, it took a while, you know, for the some cash value, you know, to accrue. I can't, at one time I knew the exact years, you know, it was after four or five years or so. Then, you know, I started having the cash value in it. But I increased the money that I was putting into it also. So remember to like, subscribe, and set that notification bell. I'll be back with more videos sharing our journey to Hawaii, what it takes to fund it, and I'm going to share with you when we get there. Uh, I should be much better at doing these videos by then. It's so funny. I got to just tell you this. I was wondering why my videos was vertical. And you know, I don't have that tripod yet. I had it going vertical instead of horizontal. So this should be a better video. I am getting better. Uh, I've um, downloaded VN as a way to edit. It's free. I got the free version to edit videos. I um, created a thumbnail today, so I'm going to see how that works. I'm working on a banner. I'm excited. I I'm a golden girl. So, you know, for me to be learning something new at this age, it's a challenge. It's a challenge, but I'm up for the challenge. It keeps the mind sharp, you know, and I'm trying to work to make sure those cobwebs don't get up in there. Um, I have come to realize as a golden girl, sometimes 
I have to learn it all over again. You know, I've been working on my cooking skills because I got so I didn't cook. So, you know, I forget things. So I've been using YouTube to <laughs> cook different uh, dishes. And I'm telling you, my cooking skills have really improved on some dishes. I've learned a lot for YouTube. And I want to do the same thing. I want to give back and be able to share with you some of my traveling accomplishments and how that I have been able to achieve them. So until later, you take care. Golden Girl here, Miss Golden Girl. <laughs> that show, The Golden Girls, that was my favorite, one of my favorites. And I'm gonna tell you before I close, I tried real hard to create that scenario, but I just couldn't get any golden girls, you know, where we stay together permanently. Um, my friend Shirley and I, two of us, we roomed together in Hawaii seven months while I was there, and Shirley is still there. And I tried to talk her into um, relocating to Georgia, and try to recruit her sister, <laughs> Ethel, so we could be the Golden Girls, but that didn't work either. And I guess it, it was good. It didn't because now I was needed here in Michigan. So I'm here in Michigan providing child care for my youngest granddaughter and house sitting. Um, family member uh, needed someone to house it. And so I've been doing that. I mean, God provides, God provides, God provides, you know, with me house sitting, I have a lot of discretionary income. And so I give it back. I give it back. I say, I'm blessed to be a blessing. And, um, I keep, God keeps providing opportunities for me to bless. Um, the trip to Hawaii, I, I'm going to cover a lot of the costs so family members and some friends can join. And with my friends, and I, I'm, I'm not going to get off on that this time, but just touch on it. Just real, um, They've provided me some opportunities for some trips and um, didn't have to pay for any accommodations. So I want to I want to return the favor. I didn't forget. I didn't forget. I've been waiting, waiting for the opportunity to be able to host in Hawaii for a month. It's been a dream of mine. While I was there, I just kept visualizing that uh, one day I could go back and I could bring my family and I could bring some friends along also. It was really something. Um, Shirley and I, we had a three bedroom apartment and no one ever came to visit us while we were in Hawaii. No one from the mainland. We had that room there and no one took advantage of it. And wow, Shirley and I both wish we knew somebody, um, to be able to get to Hawaii before we did in 2011. But, um, I'm taking some family with me and, and, and some friends uh, on this journey. All right, then. I am going to close this time. <laughs> Take care. Till next time. Bye.